guys and today I'm here with another Owl Crate unboxing. It is the July box and I believe it is good versus evil. So let's find out what I get. Oh, I can peel this. I don't need... Yep, no, I do need... I do need my trusty clippers. I can't believe I have my clippers again. This actually came this week, so I am on the ball with this one. Like, I have waited five days, not a month or, or five weeks or anything like that. I'm actually on the ball and I'm getting this done. Finding out what's in this box. I hope it's good. Here we go. You get first peek as usual. Woo! That's filled to the brim. And it looks like I have the evil box. I have another Harry Potter, another Harry Potter vinyl. I have Draco Malfoy. Now, I have a problem with this because I don't collect every single Funko Pop. So I don't know whether I'm gonna keep Draco because I have this obsession where if I have Draco, then I'll have to get someone like, um, I don't know, I feel like I'd have to get the whole range. I mean, I have Luna on this on this back. I have Neville Longbottom. They're the only two I have from this series, there we go. So I'm kind of like, eh, eh. I'd have to get like Sirius Black and I'd have to get Albus Dumbledore and then I'd have to get all, yeah, it's just, it's just the whole road I do not want to go down. I love the fact that it's Harry Potter, but I want to know what else is in this box besides a Funky Pop. I do love Draco though. I'll think about it. Let me go, let me guys know. What do I do with it? I don't know. And we have lots of stuffing. There doesn't seem to be a lot of things in this one. It's like really empty after after the Funko Pop. We have another bookmark magnet and this one is Wonderland set one. So this is Alice in Wonderland and I have got the Queen of Hearts and it says on the back of the bookmark, it says, what? Oh, turned, okay. The Queen turned crimson with fury and began screaming off with her head. Lewis, and then it has the author Lewis Carroll. Now, off with her head. Collect both of the one and set. So you can get the Queen of Hearts and you can get Alice. So I'm guessing Alice is in the good box. Stuffing, more stuffing. Let's get this. What is this? Am I not merciful? It's a sticker. I think it's a vinyl sticker. Yeah, it's a vinyl sticker. It feels like a vinyl sticker. Am I merciful? Am I merciful? Am I not merciful? I'm merciful. I'm pretty, I'm pretty forgiving and accepting of people. We also have a bookmark for Romeo and Juliet meets Indiana Jones. And the book is called Every Hidden Thing. Whoop! Every Hidden Thing. I like that. Hmm. I went close to you so I could hear your breathing and I told you you must not die. I told you to live because I'd never felt loved the way you loved me. Might check that out. That sounds really good. And we have a necklace, maybe? Maybe a necklace? I don't know. I, the thing with this box, I have not checked Instagram apart like on any of the clues at all. So I don't know what I'm getting in this box. Um, which is a good thing because you're not really supposed to know. But I did know I was getting a, I was getting a Funko Pop because of the previous box, and I'll link the video in below. And I cannot open this little box. Oh my goodness! No freaking way! We have the Death Star. This oh, I can't. It's like all tangled up. It's the Death Star. Death Star on a chain. I absolutely love this. I would wear this. And I am going to wear this. I think I'm going to wear this for episode 8 since that is now finished. Yep, episode 8 has finished filming and this is incredible. That is so cool. I like that. And it's so light. So, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Yes. I wonder what's in the good box if we, if the evil get the Death Star. What did they get in the good box? I had a feeling I'd get the, the evil box to be fair. There is so much dust on this, it is unbelievable. Like, where has this been? It's like so dusty. Okay, so we have the Savage Song by the... <gasps> oh! I have actually 
got this on my Goodreads that I wanted to read it. It's by Victoria Schwab. I've heard so many things about Victoria Schwab. Um, her previous book I haven't read. However, I've heard so many great things, so I'm so excited that I have this. And not only this, but I have her autograph. That is freaking awesome. Look at that. Victoria Schwab. And you even have the V, like the little V in the background. That's pretty cool. Pretty V. We have a little note from the author. I will read that later because some of that I don't think I'm going to be able to read out loud because the writing style of it. YA covers to colour. <gasps> So well, first of all we have we have this cover to colour in. I'm not sure if you can see that, but we have this cover to colour in. Excellent. Like that is awesome. And then what else do we have in here? Oh I'm excited to see what we have. Every hidden thing. So that's the bookmark that I got, so I can copy that from my bookmark. I have Red Queen and I have Red Queen on my shelf. Oh what is this? This is a good way to get me to check out these books because some of these I won't have. <laughs> like Lifeboat Clique by Kathy Parks, got that cover, and then we have um, Sing, is it Sing? Sing by VV Green, I think I've seen that cover. A Study in Charlotte, Simon versus the Homo Sapiens Agenda, I have seen this, I hope I'm saying that right though, I've seen the cover, haven't read it though, and Dorothy Must Die, which is a book series I've been interested in, but I'm not sure whether I will get, get them or whether I'd get around to reading them reading them because I love The Wizard of Oz and I love Wicked so I don't know. I spent my life folded between the pages of books and Tara Murphy, love her and I think I have a quote, a bookmark quote that I got from one of the previous boxes with that on or was it that, was it that um, my drink coaster, the, like the coaster I got, I think it was that maybe. We also have a card that tells us what next month's box is and this is Fast Times YA High flip for a sneak peek. And you see my face there, I'm just like, what the heck is this? But in the August box, you will, you, you'll receive an exclusively designed piece of jewellery inspired by Eleanor and Park. You do not understand how much I love Eleanor, Eleanor and Park. I really love that book. It's like one of my favourites. I think it's going to be a contemporary novel. Um, YA novel so I'm excited for that but the fact that there's gonna be a piece of jewelry by, um, inspired by Eleanor and Park has just made me like has sold it to me because I love Eleanor and Park I wonder what it could be oh it might be a music tape you know how they have the tapes in the novels music note or I don't know maybe some headphones like a little headphones on the chain I don't know let me know what you think it could be but I am so excited that it's Eleanor and Park so yeah the book the Savage Song. This cover looks amazing, not gonna lie. And it's like, it feels like really bloodthirsty. And there is an indent. Can you see the indent? I think it's like supposed to be, is it like a music note or part of an instrument? I don't know. And then we have the Savage Song on the side. Yes. I love hardbacks. On the back it says, Corsé, Corsé, Tooth and Claw, Shadow and Bone, will eat you raw. Malachi, Malachi, sharp and sly, smile and bite and drink you dry. Sine, Sine, eyes like coal, sing you a song and steal your soul. Ooh. Monsters, monsters, big and small, they're gonna come and eat you all. This sounds incredible. Kate Harker wants to be a Ruth as ruthless as her father, after five years and six boarding schools, she's finally going home to prove that she can be. August Flynn. Ooh, Flynn. <laughs> I don't know why I said that, but I just thought of Tangled, I guess. Um, wants to be human, but he does. He isn't. He's a monster, one that can steal souls with, with a song. He's one of the three most powerful monsters in a city overrun with them. His own father's secret weapon. Their city is divided. Their city is crumbling. Kate and August are the only two who see both sides, the only two who can do something. But how do you decide to be a hero or a villain when it's hard to tell which is which? Ooh, that is July's unboxing of Our Crate. I actually really like this. I really want to know what's in the good box. Let me know if you did get the good box down in the comments because I want to know what you got in it. 
but I am loving the sound of this book. Let me know what you think of this book, if you read it, tell me if it's any good. I would love to know because it's going to take me a while to get through these books because I have so many on my TBR list. But that is it for this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel and comment below. I love you guys. I really appreciate all that you do for us and I will see you soon. Bye! Unboxing of our crate. Is there a door slamming? Yeah. <clears throat>